Listen here, this over here is what's referred to as a Tesla coil. It's basically this thing that's shooting out these really, really cool sparks of electricity. Don't worry, I'm a trained professional and I'm not gonna, you know, on a live myself on camera of doing this experiment. Um, so basically, it could burn your skin potentially, but, you know, I mitigated the risk essentially by, you know, turning down the current for this type of thing. Anyway, this electricity is basically arcing through this um, grape over here. And then I'm going to eat it afterwards with a little charred flavor. Tastes a little barbecued at the end, but you're going to have to wait and see to watch me do that. Very tasty, of course. Is it my preferred method of cooking grapes? Probably not. I don't think I would necessarily want to eat a grape that's been electrocuted, but I did, and it wasn't bad. Would I do it again? Uh, I don't know. Maybe yes, maybe no, but depends. It's not exactly my preferred method. Uh, barbecue or some type of grill would perhaps be a better choice in this particular situation. However, my friends, I'm walking here. <laughs> Well, yeah, this electricity is pretty cool. Zippity zap, zippity zap. And, uh, yeah. Click on the link down below. I'm kidding. I don't know if I have a link for this one yet or not. But, hey, this thing's pretty dang cool. How about this thing on the Zon? The Umazoon. To be precise. There we go. About to eat it. Crunch. <coughs> Delicioso. This is a holographic gallium flower I made for my wife. Hope she likes it. Let's see how it turned out. I poured Whoa. a bunch of gallium into the mold, and oh my goodness gracious, golly GG wow. will occur, Batman. That thing looks fantastic. I think she's going to be thrilled. Let's see how the second one turned out, the holographic oh, gallium man. flower. Alrighty then. Alrighty then. Oh. Yep. Alright, we got a gallium flower. Ooh, That's that was a amazing. rose. A little beautiful metallic rose made out of gallium. A metal that melts at a close temperature to similar melting point as chocolate. So, I wouldn't eat the gallium, obviously, but I would eat some chocolate. I think my wife would like some chocolate probably more than a gallium flower. However, she likes everything I get her because Olivia is really appreciative, and she likes even the most impractical of gifts that I make her. Because, you know, it's a thought that counts, gentlemen, and ladies, and whatever you prefer. And, um, yeah, you know, I'm an inclusive person over here, so, you know, one love to everyone, you know. All right. Ooh, there we go. Fantastico. That turned out really great. I think she'll be thrilled. To me. If you made it this far, then.